G'day everyone, it's Alan here from Fishing Mad and thanks for tuning in to another episode. I was really restless last night. I ended up getting up at about 5 a.m. in the morning and thought, you know what, I need to get out and have a fish. I had a look at the weather forecast and the winds were 30k winds everywhere. So no good for the boat, no good for the kayak. Um, I thought I'd do a land-based bait fishing session somewhere, but because I've been using lures so much lately, there was absolutely no bait anywhere. So at 5 a.m. in the morning, I'm pulling the fridge apart, I'm pulling the freezer apart, there's no pilchards, there's no sandworms, there's no nothing, no pippies. You know what I found? The only thing that I could find was hot dogs. And you know what? I'm that desperate to get out for a fish, I thought, bugger it, I'm going to do a bit of an experiment fishing with hot dogs or skinless frankfurts and see whether we can catch something. Now as you can see behind me I am fishing underneath the Westgate Bridge today off Lorimer Street. Now this is a great spot for lots and lots of small pinkies and flathead so we're not expecting to catch monsters but it's a good place to experiment whether you can catch some fish on some skinless franks or some hot dogs. Guys thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe to the channel. There's heaps of cool fishing content all over Melbourne and Victoria, and it does really help greatly to support the channel. But you know what? Let's get fishing hot dog style. Let's go. Oh, 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 look at this. Yeah, I'm on. Oh yeah, look at this. Not bad? Yeah, it's got weight. How's this, eh? 10 seconds in on. Oh, look at the rod. It's all bunded over. <laughs> yep, gotcha. Gotcha. That's a pinky for sure. I can tell it's fighting, but it feels good. Oh, this guy's going crazy. Definitely a pinky. Oh, man. I reckon it's going to be okay size. Bloody fighting hard. There he comes. And lift up. Well, there you go, guys. We've been here all of, I'd say, a minute. And we've had baits in the water. I've had a couple of baits absolutely destroyed straight away. And that's what we're catching. Pinkies just under that 30 centimeter size. Great way to start the day. Oh, oh yeah. Definitely pinky. Definitely a pinky with those head shakes. Keep it off those rocks. Definitely got a bit of weight. Oh, has it dusted me? No. Here he comes. Oh, a double. It's a double header of pinkies. Look at this. It's going to be fun to lift up. Well, there you go, guys. Look, they just kept coming. That was a double hook up then. Hot dog bait, hot dog bait. And uh, look, this guy's a legal size. He's about 32 centimeters. This guy's obviously undersized, he's about 26 centimetres, but... Oh! Oh, this one's got more weight. Oh, yeah, this one's got more weight. Actually, pulling a bit of drag. Oh, this one's definitely got more weight. Oh, my other one's on too. My other one's on too. So this one, oh, look at this, the other rod is on. That's a that's a nice, and this rod was bouncing around too. Are you still there? Yep, you're there. There we go. Double hookup, guys, on the hot dogs. Get onto it, that's all I can say. And this one, this feels okay too. Oh, there you go guys, there's another double hookup. We've had uh, a couple of those already today. And it's just fish after fish after fish. And yes, they're all pinkies or small broom or small flathead. It's just a lot of fun catching them. Bit. Oh. Whoa, whoa, that's a better fish. What the hell is that on there? Still? Nah, I missed it. Look at the size of this flathead. That is the smallest flatty. I've seen for a long, long time. Yep, desperate calls for desperate measures. And what we're going to do is we're going to hook. Let's start with this one. I'll cut that one in half. 
and we're gonna bait those up to a little paternoster rig. All right guys, so as you can see, I am just using my Savage Gear 1D FR rod today. I got a little 2000 size reel and I have a little paternoster rig. These are pretty typical of what you'd use for small pinkies and whiting. And as you can see, for bait, we are using hot dogs. Look at that. Let's see uh, who's hungry for some hot dogs out in the big blue. Oh, here we go. Gotcha. You can tell by those head shakes, it's definitely a pinky. On the hot dog, guys. How good's that, eh? Hopefully we don't lose this one. We've lost a few near the rocks. Just going for a last run. There we go. And there you go, that's a nice... Well, there you go, guys. Look, there's another pinky. We're just catching pinky after pinky after pinky and on that hot dog for bait, which is really surprising. Um, but you know, it's a really fun form of way of fishing. It's ultra light gear. We're not casting out far. We're staying out from the breeze. And I'll tell you what, if you had young kids, they would absolutely love this style of fishing. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Another fish on here, guys. On the old hot dog. It's fighting hard. Doesn't feel that heavy, but geez, they fight hard. Yeah, another little pinky. Look at that, beautiful. Another. They just keep coming, guys. I mean, this is probably fish number 20 or 30. You sort of lose count after all. You know, all this sort of, this is a smaller one, but um, half the time you're casting out with a hot dog and then your, uh, your bait hits the water. 10 seconds later, you got one of these guys on. Again, some people might find this style of fishing, you know, a bit annoying and frustrating, not catching bigger fish. I don't mind it, I just enjoy catching fish. And again, you know, if you had some uh, beginners or uh, some kids fishing with you, they would love it. Let's get this guy back in the water. Oh, whoa, 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 look at that. Yeah. Look at that, guys, here we go. Another, just as I was lifting up, I said we're gonna watch the other rod as we're rigging up. What the hell? It's either wrapped around something or... No, they're just fast, look at them go. Speed trains. What can I say, they just keep coming. They're pretty small fish, but one thing is for sure, the catches are frequent, and they're taking this as bait, which is really weird, but a lot of fun. Let's get this guy back. Come on, gotcha. Oh, look at bend on that rod. Look at the bend there. So deceiving. It's probably a small pinky, but <laughs> double hook up. Oh, this one's this one's got a bit of weight to it. I've got a heavier sinker on, so yeah, another nice fish there. Here we go. We've got another one on, guys. Just as I was releasing another fish, it's crazy. Getting. <laughs> yep, gotcha. And this one's gonna go as well, look at this. Oh, you gotta jump onto the hot dogs, mate. <laughs> there you go, there's another one, guys. This other rod's just about to go off too. It's actually bouncing around a little bit, so. Gotcha. Love the sound of that reel. Even for a small fish, eh? And... Oh, another fish on here, guys. Lost count. There's been so many, so many fish. And you know what? They're all around that same size of small pinkies. Oh, and he's just come off. There's my buddy, the punt. I've gone head to head a few times, fishing off the little jetty there. It's a mutual respect of hate.
Yep. Oh, here we go. Look at that. Another fish, guys. This has got to be up to 50 now. It's crazy how many fish we've caught. You never know how big they are, these pinkies, because they fight really hard. And look at that. I mean, it's pulling drag. And it's not a big fish. Look at that airborne. There you go. There's a, another beautiful fish. I reckon. Oh, here you go. Oh, that was a big strike. Wow. Oh, it snagged me, I think. Let's see if we can get that one back. That was a good fish, guys. Definitely lost a good fish there. Gotcha. Definitely a pinky with those head shakes. Don't suspect it's huge, but it's fighting hard. Punch well above their weight, these guys. There's another. Oh, here we go. We're gonna easily caught probably 50 fish today. Another pinky. There we go. Look at uh, all that wind's come up, guys. So famous last cast of the day. I'm gonna give this two minutes and then we're gonna call it quits because those 30k winds are coming through. Yep. Gotcha. Crazy, isn't it? Well, there you have it, guys. I've been fishing now for about an hour and 10 minutes, and as predicted, those winds have come absolutely howling through. Um, we were expecting we're gonna have 30K winds, probably by about 8, 30, 9 o'clock this morning, and right on form, those winds are here. So we're gonna call it a day, but it has been an absolute success. Doing some experimenting with these hot dogs or skinless frankfords has accounted for so many pinkies. I would say we've caught well over 50 pinkies, and yes, the majority of those pinkies were between 25 and 30 centimetres, but it's still a lot of fun. Now, of course, we let all of those fish go. Guys, don't be one of those clowns that keeps undersized fish. It's not cool. It really isn't. So please don't do it. Abide by the rules and regulations done by Fisheries Victoria because they do a great job. But again, hot dogs. Get on them, guys. Give them a go. It's a lot of fun out here this morning. Caught heaps and heaps of fish. As always, thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And until next time, Good fishing, everyone.